So in an earlier video, you may have saw me inspecting the AC wiring in the system and getting confused and thinking something was potentially wrong. And so I've gone off and investigated a little bit and, and kind of drawn this diagram up. So this piece here is really the from the original service manual. I've modified it slightly to indicate the wire colors. Uh, they were written in there. I've just dropped my text over the top of them. Uh, an indication of the printed circuit board and the switch and power supply and even there's two of them but it'll be the same connection set and then a view looking into an, an AC outlet in the US uh, there's a small smaller hole and a larger hole the larger hole is neutral the smaller one is the hot and of course the earth ground looking at the end of the line cord if I can spot it in this direction should see neutral here, hot here, and ground. And of course, when this is flipped over, that hot flipped over plugs into the hot over here. So I, I've verified this. I looked at a couple different sites. This all seems accurate to me. And so what I want to do is compare this to the actual wiring I've got. So ultimately, the brown should come to the black here, and the blue wire coming up should go to the white. So it looks to me like it's correct, but we're going to ohm it out and make sure. And so, say this square here represents this this adapter board, and there's where the blue lead comes up into it. Uh, see if I can see the markings. Blue lead comes into it as neutral, and passes out as neutral on the white wire here. And I can see I can see the trace on the PC board. That all looks correct, but still I want to take an ohm meter to it. I got so confused looking at this before that uh, I just want to make sure uh, everything is safe and, and wired correctly. So I've got the meter here in continuity mode. We know that we see we've already tested this, and on the original power supply, let me get this in shot here. On the original switching power supply, they indicated that the earth on that was connected to the chassis. It says right here, to chassis through mounting screw. So that's how the original supply got back to earth. We've done the same thing with the mounting screws for these. That should connect to this third prong here, the round one. And it does, as expected. So let me turn the power switch on in the front. If I can find it, that's the reset. Uh, so, with, and that's the switch here. Notice that it, it 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 it's a double pole. Oh, it's a single pole double throw. And what I mean by that is it breaks both the neutral and the line uh, when it's opened. I, and that's really a safety feature and, and you know kudos to Tandy for that. It's a safety feature in that if your line cord was wired wrong, uh, the outlet in your, 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 your which is plugged into is wired wrong, there's several ways where these two leads could become swapped, line and neutral. And the reality is the switching power supply would still work, but it becomes a dangerous situation in that uh, a lot of people only break the line, so you've got power up to here and the line's broken. The way you don't have power coming into the system. But if these got swapped and the line, is, there was no switch here, the line was just brought into the system and the neutral was swapped, the problem is, is that that ends up hot all the way through and if you were to accidentally touch it, say here on the switch, you're sticking your finger down in here and on ground you could take a shot directly arm to arm. So th this increases safety. I just think it, it's a neat little thing they did. So let's look at this. I am going to get on the live, the hotter live. So there's a little chart here. Probably doesn't show up. It's got US and UK. And in the US, it's hot, neutral, and ground. And in the UK, it's live or line, neutral, and earth. And basically, green to green says, you know, th that's equivalent. It's blue in the UK. It's white in the US. It's brown in the UK. And it's black in the US. So on this side, I should be to hot live. Uh, that should be coming up to the brown wire. 
I take this little cover off here again and we should see that all the way through to the brown wire and we do and that should come to the black wire and the power supply indicates line it's got an L right here and it, it, there's an L right here to this one so that's correct and then if we take the neutral side and we do the same thing that should come to blue and that gets transposed through to the white here and the white comes through and that's marked N for neutral there and N for neutral there so we are wired correctly I don't know why I got confused with this before but this just confirms to me that the adapter board I laid out is correct uh, the silk screen markings on it are correct uh, it, it's correct all the way back to this line cord looking into the end of the line cord so there's really no problem here uh, which which pleases me I was so confused looking at that before so this will be a short video uh, there's not a whole lot else to do here besides button the system back up and I can do that off camera so I guess thanks for watching, and I'll see you in a future video.